Uh, well, it's a little bit of a, of a success, but man, this has been a, this has been a pain in the ass. Uh, I've got the rear end up on the 4x4 so far. The way we were doing it, it, it wasn't working, so we had to do it another way. I was going to, uh, I was going to video the whole thing. That way you guys could see it. But guys, I've been literally working on this thing for about an hour, hour and a half now. And it's nothing interesting. Like, you know, I'll, I'll show you guys what all I've done so far. But it would have been an hour's worth of video that you guys probably wouldn't have want to watch. So, alright, I'll, I'll show you what all I've done so far. Okay, so I've got the rear end up high enough to where I can clear the frame. I had to flatten the tires. I don't know if you guys can see all this. I had to flatten the tires to get the frame down low enough. But I had to put 6 by 6s and all that crap in here to get the rear end up. I mean, as you can see... But I started out trying, I had the blocks, I had the blocks right here, right? And then I had the blocks like right here. Well, this freaking quarter panel started breaking right here. So I had to move the blocks to here where they're at now to get it off them quarter panels because on the other side it's worse. And moved that there. So whenever I was trying to lift it, the rear end really wasn't doing nothing. It was all lifting the front. So what I'd done is I took this board right here and put it in the rear and just lifted it, lifted the rear end up. And I had my girlfriend slide blocks in. And then I would put the board in more and lift it up. And then finally we got it to where we could put that six by six in. And I had to flatten the tires on both sides. So now, with having this done, and high enough, now I've got to move to the front and get it up. The only thing I can think of is to start jacking up on both sides. Like jack this side up high, and then jack the other side up high enough, and then just keep working back and forth until it's up high enough to where I can set the blocks up and all that to put the 4x4. I'll show you guys where the quarter panel ripped at. kind of sucks. Let's see if you guys can actually see it. You see right here where the quarter panel ripped. Like it was bulging it out real bad right here. Like it is, it is no longer attached. So that sucks. That'll have to be fixed. But it's getting there, guys. I promised I'd have this bitch up, raised up today. And I'm doing my best to get it done. But once this is done, the next fun part will be to get the freaking frame out from under it. <sighs> this is a freaking job, guys. This is definitely a job. For anybody that's ever done this before, you've got you, you've got my respect. This shit sucks. But uh I don't know. I might let the camera roll on the front I don't know because this video here is only going to be about five or six minutes long so I might I might let the cameras roll on me doing the front I really don't know so I don't know but yeah guys that's it that's that's how it pretty much went but like I said I've been working at this for about an hour or so now so it's it's giving me some problems. So uh I'll I'll bring you guys back hopefully. If not, uh thanks for watching.
Okay, welcome back, guys. I'm gonna let the camera roll. I'm gonna try to get the front of it jacked up and go from there. Take it brick by brick, I guess. Uh, well, seeing how we're on this side already, we might be able to. Uh, I might be able to jack it up again, and then take both of those out to a cement block, and then maybe jack it up high enough to where we can put the board or whatever. Okay, so yeah, let's do that. So you want to take the board and brick block? Brick off, put it one of the other ones, one of the big cement rocks. Okay.
little scary guys getting a little scary that shit is, it's it's up there pretty high okay so uh kind of had a little bit of a, a setback it was just a little tiny one though uh Uh, my dumb ass forgot to take the shift boot and all that stuff off. Can you see the shifter, the 4x4 shifter right there? Yeah, my dumb ass forgot to take it off. So, I just now, just got, just now got all that taken off. The shifter's down in there. So yeah, now that that's all taken off, now I can get it finish getting the rest of it lifted off. Oh man, I'm thinking, thinking that's it though. That should be everything. Like it should be 100% ready to go now. It looks like it is. Okay, I'll bring you guys back in a few minutes. Okay, guys, we're back on the passenger side now. Okay, welcome back guys. So, uh, we got it lifted. I still need to tinker with it some more because it still needs to go up a little more. Uh, these blocks here ain't holding it up. It's these blocks here now. I just got, I, I just left them blocks there for, uh, some, you know, just in case something happens and it falls or something. I don't know. But, uh, the rear end needs to come up some more. It's bending, bending that piece right there where the thing's at, but it needs to come up some more because on this back side, on this back side here, it's lower. So it needs to come up some more because see here, the bumper, I'd have to take the bumper off to get it out and I don't feel like doing all that, but I'm freezing my ass off here. So I'm done for the day. Only thing I got left to do is just cover the motor up with a tarp or something so it don't get wet. And I got some jack stands sitting there for no reason actually. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's it's there. Uh, I definitely have to give people props that's done this with blazers before. If you've if you've ever done this to a blazer before you have my respect because this shit sucks this is some sketchy 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 freaking shit here but for you guys that's got like cranes and shit and you know or uh, uh forklifts or something you guys are whole you guys are different but for those of you that's doing shit like this you've got my respect like crazy because this is some sketchy sketchy shit so but yeah guys that's th this is pretty much the end of the video you know the end of this video i'm gonna try to get some more done within the next couple of days but right now you know i've got some shit i gotta do so i have to be done for the day so uh yeah i mean at least it's up in the air now 
uh, but thanks for watching guys I hope you guys like the video uh, please like and subscribe you know to the channel like the videos it helps me out a lot guys so you know I always appreciate every view that I get so yeah just hit that like button and I appreciate it guys